Hello everyone, we are back with the GSA May North American versus tournament. I am Jai Bloxman, once again joined by the wonderful Maximum Color here. I'm wonderful. Yes, you are. And also Maximum. <laughs> so we are in the losers finals here. Colin versus Evan Breaks Games. Here's how our runners got here. We have Colin, who won against The Haunt in the Losers' semifinal, and Evan, who lost in the Winners' final. The winner of this will go into the Grand Finals. To beat up Aizen. Yeah, Losers' final? That sounds kind of bad. I mean, they're, they, they've won a lot. I don't know why we call it Losers' final. People are definitely not losers by any stretch of the term. They are winners. Slightly less winners this month oh wow is that a mask hoodie sky high switches by jeffy milk what what a weird name jeffy milk and the question mark too like jeffy milk uh so we are up in the sky and here we are we can see our runners once again colin is off to the early lead, oh, to the early Ooh, death. Trying to go above on those on-off switches, but the Thwomp takes him out. Fast. You gotta trust these switches, man, these... You gotta trust both the switches and where your fellow runner is. For sure, the other runner can mess up the on-off blocks quite a bit. But Evan not has the Yoshi, has the clown car, gonna fly all the way to the right, see what he can find. And the goal and victory is what he finds. Well done, Evan. That was quick. Two minutes in, we got a victory. I've been seeing that a lot. There's all these on off levels, and you'd think that they'd be really hard multiplayer. Like, one player could just sit there and keep activating them back and forth repeatedly and mess up the person in the lead, but that doesn't seem to be happening. Yeah, we haven't seen that too much today. Uh, perhaps it's because we're doing all expert levels. Uh, Bowser's tank trouble. I wonder what the trouble with his tank is. I guess we'll find yeah. out. Are we going into the tank? Is that what this is? I think so. Both Colin and Evan are entering. Oh, this looks like one of the... Uh... Like SMB3 end levels. Oh, yeah, you're right. Both Very runners nice. take a early death, getting cannonballed, build something there. And it's an auto-scroller, that's... It's really bad for races, and at least for me, it's really bad for patience. I always tend to die a lot on these, because, you know, you want to go fast, but you just can't go fast. And things like that end up happening. Yeah, Evan's actually on the bottom there. I didn't even realize that that was what? ground. Oh, he went back up. Oh, he wanted to check the oh, pipe. Oh no! It was a death pipe, but he found good. He found good cheese. If he can just get down there and run along the bottom, he should be safe. Oh, the Colin found it too. Yeah, because the lifts aren't there, so you can just run along the bottom there, much faster, of course. Three boom booms, not gonna bother at all. Let's see if Does Colin can make pass the oh, angry the same oh. pipe. <laughs> This time gets chomped. Alright, Evan has another chance. We're just trading back and forth, jumping into that pipe. Yeah, Evan knows the lore though. He knows what's going on. Jumps Ooh, on top of the Wiggler. He sees some Lakitu. Is he gonna try to go for the cloud? He does not. He's running. He's uh, back on the ground. Yeah, it seems like the ground's a safe place. Lakitu aren't really throwing much. And here we go, Evan taking the second win so far, putting himself at a sizable lead. You made it. I'm checking out... Checking out the chat over here, it looks like we were having some like frames dropping or something. Ooh, yeah. Unfortunate. With that, uh... Oh, gosh. <laughs> Sorry, my mic just fell. 
startled me. All right, we are hanging tight, Milo. Do not worry. Hanging loose might be a more comfortable option, though. They might not be able to hear that really bad joke, though. Yeah, with all this quarantine stuff that's going on, uh, I know the internet has been tanking across the world. Oh, it's ridiculous. So unfortunately, there might not be too much we can do about it. All right, looks like we're back. Oh. I'm checking it out, refreshing my browser, seeing what's going on. We are playing again, though. We have started our level search. Alright, thanks for hanging in with us through the difficulties, fellas. Try not to rage. As poor Saul likes to remind us. Yes. Try not to rage. Uh, Evan breaks games. I mean, that might indicate a history of rage breaking games. Mm -hmm. But it could just mean that he's good at uh, metaphorically breaking them, figuring out the strats, going very fast. Uh, he definitely has a history of this happening, just unluckily. <laughs> Colin does not bother with grabbing the key, just moves right along, hitting the on-off switches. Dodging the, dodging the bullets, not quite dodging all of them, and that Goomba just stomps right on his non-existent body there. Meanwhile... Evan with the stiletto, going, trying to go for his third win. Oh, he's got his little pointy ear hat on as well. The elf in the boot. Yes, it's not Zelda. Moving right along here, through the corridor. Okay, Doki. Not much going on. Okay. That's what I was about to say. Not too much to say here. Um, we just got some... On my end, it looks a, li a little laggy, but, you know, we're just going through corridors, leaving the boot behind so that we can get past these donuts, but we still got the Link suit. And making well, it to a checkpoint. You see Colin a little bit. Colin sighting. Wild Colin sightings are rather rare. Very nice to see one. Man, Evan just making use of these shells, not hesitating at all. Yeah, Throwing I know. them down, blocking them. The sword play, very advanced. And the jump play, he's really been been noticing that. He keeps like knocking the <laughs> knocking the shells and then jumping off of them. Oh. Man. That was a little unfortunate. Moves under but the flops. Making his way through. Don't think he really needs the Zelda suit unless there's a check at the end. He's shown himself to be very adept right now. Oh, and there oh, is a check key. at the end. Was it wow. necessary? The key led to a bonus room. Yeah, that was just a bonus room, wasn't it? Excellent, cool. We can continue climbing up these vines like Donkey Kong. Uh, is that possible? Not quite. Oh, Ooh, and he... Not able <laughs> to get the slide. He realizes he messed up. Yup. Decided to go ahead and take the death. I believe he was considering uh, waiting for Colin, seeing if maybe Colin would come free him. But Colin also doesn't have the power-up, so Evan is actually in the lead again, despite being behind. Yes. That's the kind of confusion that... Yeah. Alright, so Colin going to be making a big run-up. We're going to have to see if he's able to sneak under those prana plants. Does not look like it. His marker disappeared. He is presumably dead. Yep, there he is. Respawned. Meanwhile, Evan is making his way very, very quickly through here. He knows what's going on. He knows the lay of the land, and he just has to navigate through this uh, little jungle maze again. Alright, All right, there we go. Wait, what? <laughs> just shielded the piranha plant off of the roof? That was Man. a very clever play. If Colin doesn't make it there with the... With the uh, Power up, he can't get through now, otherwise, he would have been able to get through. That was smart. 
Most definitely. Uh, we see some sort of boss fight here. And then trying to figure out what he needs to do. Attacking the Chain Chomp. There's the Bowser Jr. So it's He's gotta find weird. an on-off switch. It's like a bootleg Mecha Bowzilla. Without the boots and the legs. Ooh. Barely just a survival. He's gotta wait for that, uh... Spike killer to hit the on-off. Oh, yeah, it's actually a really easy survival just because the sword will keep respawning. It's a multiplayer. Oh. Evan's doing things at his leisure. Probably a very good thing he blocked off Colin. And there he goes. Gets through, reaches the goal. 3-0, oh. once again. Now this. I used the term a lot, but right here, we need the true reverse sweep for Colin to come back. Yes, we do, and we've seen the reverse sweep today. Four in a row, can we do it? Just give, him a little, give him a little encouragement, guys. Any Colin fans in the chat, tell him. Let him know that he can do it. Yeah. Land Looks of like Hyrule. Have... Ah, another Zelda level. Yeah, we're still having a little bit of frame dropping, it looks like. Checking in on the chat between matches. Yeah, uh, the Milo PowerPoint. It's always Milo's fault. Except for when it's Twitch's fault. It's either Twitch or Milo every time. Well, I mean, those aren't the two parties. Yeah. But with all the jokes we make, we love Milo. We love what he does. Uh, Evan making his way through this little cave section, <laughs> and <laughs> just... That Chuck's just like, no, you can't hide from me. <laughs> Fool. Okay, Colin does have the... Okay, we just, we just got a better play-by-play. -play. For those of you who cannot see what's going on on the screen, we have Colin in the lead with the Zelda suit. Or the Link suit. Moving forward. He loses the Link suit to a flying Chuck. Is gonna Both of our runners one. All right. right next to each other. Colin just barely beating out Evan in order to get another power-up. Both of them losing the power-ups. Colin surviving while Evan takes a death. Colin is yes. in the lead, but no power-ups. Yes, and he does need that Link suit to actually beat the level. It is the clear condition. We're going to have to see what happens. He's in the cave now. Looks like uh, the Link power-up would be very uh, beneficial to him right now. He can take out the Piranha Plants, hit that P-switch with the arrows... Which looks like he needs to, to progress. And he doesn't really have any options right now. Except maybe that jump, that jump might be possible. But uh, Evan is now here with the Link suit. Coming in to and save the day. We got some piranha plants on the ceiling, shooting fireballs at everyone. P-switch on the ceiling. Evan takes out Colin using his um, the little ground pound, uh, the sword drop. Unfortunate though, Evan, right as he hits the P-switch, loses his Link suit. Hoping for another one to occur later in the level. Okay, Colin making his way through, dodging some Chucks, taking out some Wigglers with his sword, taking out Chucks with his sword, jumping over some uh, acidic water that's rising and falling, and going into a pipe. Will this be the end for him? He has the clear condition. It's a very long level. Oh, some blocks are falling. Looks like they're trying to crush our runners. So we take aim back at this P-switch. We're back in this uh, piranha plant room. All right, there we go. He gets it. He does not lose his suit to the fireball like Evan did. Evan was ahead in the level, but now he might be dead. All right, yeah, he did not have the link suit to blow through this wall. We got a wall Colin that we're blowing up. Colin getting through the pipe, and we see the end. He just has to get Ooh, past a very right. tall spiny, which yep, should be easy with the sword. Alright, very safe. There he goes. Alright, and with that, Colin reaches the goal, taking his first win and is tied up one, or not tied up, it's now one to three in Evan's favor.
once again checking in on this chat. Definitely an exciting match. Colin is trying to get his way back up. If he can, if he can climb his way, I mean, I, I would not be, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Our runners, both of them, experiencing lag. It's just all around internet issues. Bear with us here. We have winter snowland. We'll just have to keep up the play-by-play -play commentary. All right, both of our runners have boots, and we're off uh, jumping and climbing through some uh, some very tall, tall jumps here. Yes, um, using uh, the boot to jump up and out. Yeah, it's basically it's just it's another boot level. A lot of spikes that we got to jump over, but there's a lot of aerial jumps and uh, using the mechanic of jumping out of that boot as well, um, pushing it through the bouncers and all that life. We have a key door, but no key in sight. We have a uh, spiny shell, gonna be used as a helmet here. So we have a ring of booze circling around a Lakitu cloud. We gotta try and take him out, find the key, unfortunately. We lose the helmet. Will another one respawn? It should do to multiplayer. Yeah, he is gonna wait for the respawn. Goes in and out of the pipe to make it respawn faster. And Evan... he is just gonna have to try to find the right one. Well, I believe it's uh, once you take all of them out, they all count as one enemy. Oh, yes, you're right, you're right. So slowly, as this Lakitu dips down, and this is honestly kind of annoying. <laughs> wonder how the runners feel right now. Um, yeah, Colin is nowhere to be seen. Probably sort of an equalizer. Colin could come up here. And maybe he's waiting at the key door right now. Okay. We have one more boo to take out. And Evan misses it. Get it next cycle. We'll get it. There, there we, we go. go. We have a key. Let's see if Colin is waiting at that door or not. He's not. Colin is still way back at the beginning. Not sure what's going on for him. Good to know. Audio is apparently perfect. And with that, Evan does reach the goal, taking the fourth win and taking the match. Hopefully within the next 12 minutes before our grand finals match, we'll be able to resolve some internet issues. Um, either way, hey, thanks for, thanks for showing up. Thanks for watching us. And please stay tuned for will be Evan versus Eisen in the next match. Very exciting.